It is Players Only. Welcome to Players Only on TNT, presented by State Farm and one of the best atmospheres in the entire association. The times these two teams have met, they've all been decided by four points or less. So Celtics have been comfortable in this Morris, Horford, Kyrie, and Tatum. And keep in mind, no Clay Thompson. You know, Steve Kerr talked about the ways that they're going to have to adjust their defense to accommodate Boogie Cousins. Yeah, it's called two, three zones. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, I think he might have lost a little half a step maybe on the defensive end, but it didn't look like it on that last play, that's for sure. Smart in rhythm there by Kyrie to force the turnover on the McKinney pass. Morris quickly able to knock down that jump shot. And I think Steve Kerr is going to want to have... The rotations have to be different. You might see a little bit of zone, might see a little bit of tilt, might even see a lot of switching, one through five, on the perimeter. And able to get that one to go in green with the rebound. Yeah, for Damian Lee coming in, you see the effect right away. Come on. That can stretch it a little bit more. Yeah, going again, quickly into the front court. Step. Knocks down that triple. They swing it around to Morris back to Kyrie. Good defense there. That was a tough. If, if you're the Warriors, you couldn't be mad at that shot. You did everything right. Rotated back over. It was just a heck of an offensive play. Yeah, that was just a big defensive play. Exactly, because when he gets switched on the bigger play, he's crafty enough to still be effective. Yeah, that's a welcome sight there. Making sure he didn't get a wide open three. Yeah, he's not giving it up. Baines is going to be the one that will have to step in there and take that. And yeah. how about the open look? Home stretch going into the second half of the season. I mean, Golden State knows exactly what it is. It's, it, it's Steph Curry, it's Kevin Durant, AD, a consistent basis. Who's their third best player? And, and obviously, who's that utility guy, the glue guy that keeps everything together game to game like tonight? Established. They're, you know, they're the second and third best players behind Kyrie right now. Kyrie, speaking of, Ooh. knocks down a very has the talent to be that, but at this stage of his career, I, I just don't think from a maturation standpoint he's ready to take on that low in terms of being a champ. is more competitive than what we saw last year, so the challenges with that is also has also impacted how we view Kansas. This is about as good as I've seen them work as a unit defensively in a while. David off the pump fake gets into the lane. And I tell you, he's looking absolutely terrific on both ends. And so he might ultimately end up being the X Factor when you look at the Celtics team as we get closer to the postseason. Lee. David. I want to see a competitive fire. I want to see us compete. I also want to see us get back to playing defense the way we were accustomed to playing. And that's what he was talking about in that timeout. <laughs> down that triple off a good ball and guys this is kind of a situation where to me right Orford's got to feel like that's a matchup he's got to win is Hayward shooting air ball there I think L Horford has got to become a little bit more selfish on the offensive end score but for a beautiful play by Terry Rozier it's amazing to see how coach Kerr with his resume he already recognizes that as you see, the three picks are going to have to be different coming down the stretch. And I think they'll be ready come playoff time. Right on cue. Very much like the team we thought they'd be all season here through the first 14 minutes. And they will continue. That's the shot he takes it. If it's a dribble drive and a guy is guarding him, he's taking it to the basket. And that three right there. It Down that triple off Achilles tendon. Raymond King on the help there, but Tatum match up particularly well against other teams, and that's exactly what you're seeing right now. Boston having to play his best basketball. Big, and how about that defensive play there by Draymond? We're talking about the defensive effort. We're talking about the leadership. All that has to be. Welcome back, and so Terry Rozier is the Ooh. funniest, and right now Celtics have their starters back in the game. Nice line there by Kyrie Gray. Every in the first half, being more of a facilitator, he'll pick and choose the spots, kind of like Steph right here on this shot. <laughs> <laughs> Smart 
talked about it. He's going to use his body there. And there is great mind. Great job. He fell asleep a little bit and able to get that tip. And kind of watching Durant get to the back to see Kyrie get to his sweet spot right about 15 feet. Right. Durant to try to squeeze it through that tiny gap. Tice is giving him some solid minutes to Gordon Hayward continues to next spasm. So a little short in that bench. And there's Smart on cue with that deflection. Gets it back to. You trying to put me on front street. I did put you on front street right there. <laughs> Man, this is a healthy sack. And Mark is more. From a defensive perspective, to stay locked in. Oh, how about the pass wow. there by Smart? But more shit will give you a synopsis. Of this first half, Kyrie creates some space there. They can knock down that jump shot. Making the right read there, but they were unable to knock that one down. So smart. Why not? Delivers with a deuce there. Putting on the line and 25 point lead.